Hello and welcome to another soft and gentle episode of Heavenly Album Covers. And here we have an album cover by The Plasmatics from New York City. This is an amazing scene that is taking place on this album cover. Here we have uh, lead singer Wendy O. Williams sitting defiantly on top of a large white automobile. Here is one of the other key members, Richie Stotts, sitting in a large tire tube with his Flying V guitar and he's wearing a ballerina thing and he has large shoes on. This car looks like it, it has, had just been driven into this swimming pool and here are uh, three other members of the group looks like this fellow is playing a strange guitar this fellow is bashing in the fronts of television sets with a sledgehammer and this guy here is lounging on a chair near another television set and it just so happens to be that there is a large fire here on the edge of the pool this lettering is magnificent it's got to be at least two and a half three inches tall it's a great logo with these stripes running through it and uh, if I didn't mention it before this album is called New Hope for the Wretched and uh, this cover here this cover photo is a fine statement of the band and really kicked off their career let's see what's on the back here we have the band again with the the car in the swimming pool. Here's Wendy Woe Williams, Richie, and uh, the other band members hanging out. They're not doing too much, and it looks like they're situated in a big park with a lot of trees. And um, let's look a little bit closer at these folks here, the plasmatics. they look like they've just come back from a party or maybe they just played a gig and let's look at the cover photo again there's Wendy O. Williams a groundbreaker really she was ahead of her time And so that's the first album by the Plasmatics. It's on Stiff Records. And here's their second album, which is called Beyond the Valley of 1984. This cover is a little less violent and crazy. It looks like the band, or most of the band, is uh, in the desert. And they're uh, holding their arms up in defiance and uh, looks like the horses are very nice and once again we have that plasmatics logo back here it's a little subdued here and uh, Richie Stotts is here you gotta love his expression it's quite appealing with his blue mohawk and um, it seems like they got a little bit more money to spend on their album because this one is a uh, a shiny gatefold LP. In the gatefold you can see that the band are um, fleeing from some sort of mayhem. This uh, tent, actually it's not a tent, it's a car has uh, exploded and uh, there's various horrible things happening. There's a helicopter probably taking uh, photographs there's the car. I think it might be the same car that was in the swimming pool on the first album. And uh, there are the plasmatics. The whole scene is chaotic and wonderful. And uh, that's the gatefold. And uh, the rear view of the album cover is just, uh, it's the chaos after the event after the explosions and uh, horribleness 
there are people on the ground. It's like a disaster scene. And uh, here are the plasmatics down here. It looks like they're down to four members. And uh, this also is on Stiff Records. And uh, the plasmatics did, I think, about three more albums. And then Wendy O. Williams had a solo career. And um, she had a tragic ending. But um, she really made her mark on the musical society of her time.